My name's uh, Tom Melanetti with uh, FLIR Maritime, and we're introducing here the new FLIR M100 uh, and M200 series cameras. They're introduced this year at the uh, Miami Boat Show. Um, the difference is the M100 is tilt only. It has a joystick control unit in a standard 320 by 240 resolution, which is kind of the industry standard for a thermal camera. And then we have an M200, which is tilt and pan. So a pan and tilt camera, uh, both at uh, really kind of exciting new pricing. Um, the M100 starts around $24.99, and the uh, M200 is uh, $34.99. So, you know, prior to that, the uh, the least expensive pan and tilt from FLIR was, was $9,000. So, you know, for $24.99 and $34.99, it's a very cost-effective uh, uh, marine thermal camera that's in a pan and tilt format. So what we're looking at here is uh, there's a little joystick that can come with it. It's an accessory. You can get the joystick. Uh, it's an additional like $350, $350 retail. Uh, but it's, you know, you can pan and tilt the camera. You see that it's in a white hot image there where warmer objects in the scene are are lighter in color and cooler objects are darker in color. And let me to back up, this is only seeing in the infrared spectrum, so it's not seeing what our eyes see, it's not seeing visible light. So the image that you're seeing there on the screen is the same as you would see it in complete total darkness. So it's, it's a very good tool to use uh, on the water at night to be able to see things like other boats, uh, to see navigation aids and markers and those kinds of things. Um, and also as a search and rescue, if somebody unfortunately, were, were, you know, unfortunately would go overboard, uh, there's no better tool in the toolbox to have in a thermal camera to try to find that person at night. So an accessory little joystick control unit here uh, with various features. We've got different uh, colors. We can flip-flop the polarity of the screen. So now it's black hot, so warmer objects are now dark in, in color and, and cooler objects are lighter in color. Uh, we've got different uh, palettes that we've added this year, uh, which more, which is really more just for um, you know operator. Um, it's their choice to use. This was, a lot of it's just more entertainment to be able to see a thermal camera when you're at the dock, you know, in some in some pretty cool uh, color palettes. But some very useful ones is too. I'm going to show you one here. This one actually is called uh, uh, Heat Cold where we have the hottest parts of the scene are highlighted in kind of an orange and red, and the coolest parts of the scene are, are highlighted uh, in blue. Uh, kind of makes it a little more apparent. And then one that's just the heat, which kind of a graded heat uh, palette, uh, makes it very useful to see things. Now, we're in, we're in a boat show here, so there's a lot of people. It's a little more... Uh, you know, a little more saturated, uh, but out on the water, if there was something, you know, ahead of you, another boat, uh, navigation aid, to have that color uh, be, you know, that's, that's kind of superimposed on the object makes it very apparent uh, to the operator. So, all right, that's the uh, the M100 and M200 in a, in a nutshell. V very excited about this product. You know, it kind of makes it a very exciting price point uh, to get into the, particularly the recreational boating market. Um, very affordable pan and tilt thermal camera.